Hey YouTube fam, how are you today? So, I went through my whole collection and I picked out my top 10 palettes of 2021. And let me tell you, it was the hardest thing I ever had to do. <laughs> Um, I couldn't even decide what I wanted to put in my eyes, so I actually pulled from almost, like, probably about three or four palettes to do this look. I think that's why I like these so much, because they play together, too, so I can create looks, and I'm inspired. So, number 10 will be the Michaela um, and Glam Light collab. This was the color story. Um... I pull from this a lot when I'm needing a rainbow. This is probably my favorite rainbow palette that I own. Um, and it's got it's got the shimmers too. So I really like the formula. They work well with all, like anything I pair it with, it works well together. So this is definitely one that I love. Number nine is my Lois in Cosmetics, Meet Me in the Underworld. Y'all, I had so much FOMO over this for the longest time. <laughs> like, every time I came back in stock, like, it sold out. And I was like, no! And I finally got my hands on it. And I really love it. I like the grungy colors. Um, I think this is a really auto, like awesome like autumn winter palette. The only reason it's not higher on my list is just because, like... Like, mo like it's other palettes, like, I can look at it and I can do, like, so many different, like... Like, my brain just, yeah, this one, like, it's like, I know if I, I thought about it for a while, I could make a whole lot of different looks, but there's like, I get, I always want to pull the same look out of this palette, but I love it. I love the artwork. I love the formula. Amazing. All right. Number eight. We got the Melt Cosmetics. This is the uh, Mori Mariposa palette and this is the color story on this um this is just gorgeous um i am inspired every time i look at it i think of something else to do with it the formulas are this is the good 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 melt formula um i don't have any problems with any of my melt formula like any of my melt palettes only got what four but still like but this is like probably the best out of them and I'm so glad I got it. Alright, number seven is the Midas Cosmetics um, with the Basic B Perception Palette. This is probably my most reach for palette. Um, I just really like the formula. I just like the color story. It's just awesome. It worked. Midas cosmetics in general like their formula is amazing but this color story oh I had to have it all right number six is the passion in Paris by BH cosmetics this is the color story I really like this deep dramatic like purples in the like the blues and like the reds uh, just all of it so it's my color story so and BH has awesome 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 um, formulas. So if you never tried them, they're super affordable. They always have sales and yeah, go check out BH. All right. Number five is the Tentalia and Sydney Grace. This is the Quintessence, right? Yeah, the Quintessence palette. This is just a jewel tone, deep, dark dream. And Sydney Grace's formulas, I haven't tried anything from her that's bad. So, I really like that one. Next up is, uh, this is what, number four? This is the Age of Opulence. I'm sure you've seen a pattern with these color stories. <laughs> um, I've actually used this a lot. Um, this is going to probably be my most used palette um just because of the tones in it it's gorgeous it blends well they're amazing they look so pretty um and i do have all of these that i'm going through i have videos on so if you want to go back you can see swatches you can see my look you can see my deep end review that's why i'm not really going in too much with it because i've had these videos all right so next up is a net 
Pets um, collab with Onzai, the Giant Wolves. This. Oh, <laughs> this is probably like my favorite look I did all year was with this palette. Um, Odinzai is awesome. And their shimmers are awesome. And their formula is awesome. And their artwork, it's just the whole package. Um, so, I do like this one. So, I guess I should give the most valuable player award to Annette because her other palettes went number two, her Serenity palette with Menagerie. Um, I looked out because it sold out and then they restocked it and I got it on the, uh, on the restock. Um, this is it, as you can... I don't know if you can actually go see how it's really dirty. This is um, a well-loved palette as well this year. Um, I mean, considering I have over 100 palettes and I use this this much, it says something. And number one should not be a surprise to anyone. I searched for this. Every time it came available, I didn't have the money to buy it. And it sold out as soon as, like, oh, I think, yes, I got paid. I go, and it sold out. I was like, shit. <laughs> so, I paid a good chunk for it, but I'm so glad to have it. Um, Kaleidos is probably my favorite brand of the year. Angelica is probably one of my favorite YouTubers. Like, it don't matter. She could upload a picture of five minutes of her sneezing and I would watch the whole thing because I love her so much. Um, so this is my number one. Um, it's just my precious. It's my precious. So I'm curious what are your favorite palettes for 2021? There could have been more. I could have made it like, <laughs> like I wanted to pull so many but I was like let me keep it to 10 but these are ones that I, you they're going to the coffin with me. And if they don't go in the coffin with me, I will haunt my family and friends until they put it in the coffin. So, all right. Well, um, I hope you guys have a great weekend. Um, uh, I'm trying to think. We still have the um, the contest for Christmas going on. And I'll pick a winner Christmas weekend, which is next weekend. I'm hoping to get a couple more videos up. I'm not really sure what the holidays coming. We've got it's less it's like a week oh my god <laughs> so i'm gonna try i'm gonna see what i can do all right well um if i don't talk to you before then merry christmas and i love you guys don't forget to like and don't forget to subscribe and i will see you soon bye